um, how would you like me to do this? Okay, so tell me about this. This is, we're going to make a yurt, and um, these are the walls. Here's going to be the panels. I actually have, well, you, you really these should are, come when we're actually making them. Yes, well. Because what we do is, are we on now? Yeah. What we do is we have a wooden frame, which we put down on here, and we layer three layers of piece. One going in one direction, one going in the other, one going in this direction. And then we put on our colours and make our pattern. And then we cover it all with another piece of um, sheer, sheer curtain. And then we cover it with, wet it down with soap, soapy water and exclude all the air. And then, then we roll it all up in the solar blanket and jump on it. That's so uh, you mean it's 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 jumped on when it's a big roll? Yes. I well, we see. We will jump on it before it's the roll. But the actual felting, which is the real pressure and the pushing up and down, it's much more successful if it's done on the solar blanket with um, rolled up because you get a lot more pressure. So what we have to do now is to take these guys off. And this one hasn't been uh, felted sufficiently, and you'll see when we unwrap it, it's not nearly as um, tight as that one. So this isn't fleece. It oh, isn't, I see. It's yeah, enough. it's fat. It, yeah, it's not enough. Uh -huh. So we have to take these ones off. Okay. And I'm wondering whether we could actually... What is this on? Uh, this is on a sheet. Is it a sheer? It's a sheer and a sheet, this one. Oh, crap, it's getting in there. Please. Oh, sorry. We can put it on the sheet. So we just, I'll, I'll fold this up. Yeah. We can use the sheet. Well, here, I've moved this one out of the way. Oh, no, I thought I could just spread this out and we could put it on this one. Because this is. Okay. Um, I've got, I think I've got another shear there. But now this is all empty here. Do you not want to put it on this? Yes, I do. I'm sorry, I'm just going to make some more space. Okay. I'll take the others away. The others will have to vacate me. There. Now we can put those. You can see how much felting it needs. It's so much more fluffy. So this is one we've done. I mean, I had these on the line, and I, I photographed them. And you did what? I photographed them. Oh, but good. Because I couldn't photograph, I couldn't hang that one on the line. Because it wasn't really it enough. It wasn't, um, quite felted enough. Now, what should we do? Should we put the other one out on the... Sure, so people can see what they are? There's that one. Now this is the shear that the birds made a mess on. Mm. <laughs> How big is this of this shear? I think that shear is big enough. So when you make a yurt, what is the, um, what is the, found, uh, not foundation, what is the, the frame, frame going to be made of? The frame has been already made by Peter Burnett, and it's going to be, um, it's, it's expandable, and it's rather like, you know when you put a fence out um, across the door to keep the dogs from coming in, or a child gate, it's that sort of expandable thing. Okay. These are two that we've done. I didn't bring the third. But it's quite nice for people to see what we've done. It's amazing. Because these will need needle felting. These actually do need a bit more felting. But they are together. one that 
that needs wetting and soaking. And felting. Well, I've got a bit more felt if we need it. One corner's rather thin. We need a bit, yes, we've got some stuff around here to go around. You see, this is bad. Yeah, I see that all the way across the Yeah, and, it, and it's not it's not together as a felt. Right. So we've got to... Need a felt that. Well, no, we're going to tread it. We'll make it a felt today. We'll get people to walk on it for us. Oh, I see, okay. Trying to make it sort of fairly even. But you can see there are no layers in this. No. Such. Now, we're, are the layers there because that's how you put it together? Yes. And is that the case with all of them? Yes, they were all put together like this, see? I see, okay. And they just haven't been felted enough. Now, this little butterfly looks as though it's... Uh-oh, we're not enough. Mm -hmm. Oh. Well, let's just see if it... I'm not quite sure what that is, but it's... And then... So I to make sure all these things It's a little piece of purple. Oops. Didn't come. Yeah. Yeah. I don't quite know what these things are. I'm hoping that these things will all stick on nicely. There's a little piece that... I wonder where that came from. Do you think it came from here? Maybe up... Maybe the body? On top? Mm -hmm. Or vertically? Now, how about these ones? So, anything else that needs arranging, do you think, before we wrap her up? So now I think we wrap her up. Oh, I see, okay. This will come down. I did this up here at the market, but we didn't have enough people. This is a bit out of shape. I don't think it really matters because we can probably cut it when it's finished. I was thinking we shouldn't make our shapes too close to the edge, which we have here. I'll get the other side. Now it would be nice if we could get, we could wrap, let's wrap the under over and then the over under. To bed, isn't it? Oh, there we are. So it's all contained now. And now we don't use the solar blanket yet. The solar blanket just waits until it has its turn. I'm just going to take my thread like that and get the watering can and then we water. Okay. I hope the cat's on. I've